him and I play some gasping. Yeah, How's sure. Ricky doing? Well, he's all right. He's still in agony with his fingers, you know. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, I told him he shouldn't be back at work yet. Told him this morning. There you go. Ta. In fact, I think he should go and see the doctor. Let him write him off sick for a couple of weeks. I mean, I don't believe it. First you nearly get your hand chewed off, then he said he don't want you around. I know, and after all I've put up with from him, I mean, you wouldn't believe what it's been like these past few weeks. Snap him your head off every five minutes. Well, you can sue him, you know. Damages, negligence. Oh, I wouldn't waste my time. <laughs> anyway, I think he's done me a favour. I think I'll go and see my dad for a while. Don't have to do that. You can be a kept man for a bit. Yes, have one apple, please, Mark. Just one? Yeah, one orange and one banana. You don't have to be like this. So it's my fault you're leaving me, is it? I'm not leaving you. I'm just going away for a bit. And when will you be back? Soon. How soon? I don't know exactly. Well, you better cross them fingers of yours that I'll still be in. That's a quid. Yeah. Bianca? What? I can't leave like this. But don't I get a kiss goodbye? No. Are you doing anything tonight? Well... Why don't you come up to my place? Have tea there. Man, the, the thing is... You've never asked me round for tea. It's because Ricky's always there. Well, I'm going into the pictures, so... Sarah Hills? Yeah. Right. We're moving out then. Oh, at the weekend. What's Peggy got to say about it? Not much, but she ain't got much choice, has she? Cheers. Yeah.